Nothing brings me more joy than looking at beautiful cherry blossom trees in full bloom. Absolutely gorgeous. And I love these beautiful daffodils. You know what else brings me joy? A trip to my mailbox. So let me go ahead and see what's waiting for me. Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Louisa. I hope everybody's doing well. I hope you're staying healthy, following all the guidelines. I know these are very scary times and you know, when, uh, there's a lot of uncertainty about what's going to happen, but you know, just follow the guidelines, keep your distance from people, stay inside. Sometimes I feel like this virus took spring away from us, but um, if you're healthy and you can go out into your backyard, for instance, if you have spring flowers or trees that you can enjoy, I say go ahead and do it. Just, you know, make sure you keep your distance and everything should be okay. Thank goodness that we have this beautiful hobby of ours where we can sit down and stay inside and make beautiful jewelry. If it weren't for that, I don't know what, what we'd be doing, but I'm sure we'd find something. But one of my goals is to make a bunch of bracelets. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold on to the bracelets until this pandemic is over. And then I'm going to give them away to the, to the people who work in grocery stores, people I know, people who work in the healthcare field. Uh, those people put their lives on the line every single day for us. And I'm so grateful to those people. So if there are any people out there that are in those fields, Thank you so much. I appreciate everything you've done from the bottom of my heart. And I hope you stay safe and you and your family. So anyway, guys, um, today I have a special treat. I received a shipment from a company called Softflex. It's their monthly design kit. It's a mystery kit, so I have no idea what's in it. I think the name of it is called Sunflowers after Van Gogh. Um, it's called Painted Sunflowers after the artist Van Gogh and the sunflower painting that he created. Um, so anyway, guys, I am so excited to open up this kit and see what's in it. Um, I'm sure it's going to be beautiful. So anyway, let me turn my camera around and we'll get set up and I'll tell you a little bit more about this kit and how much it costs and a little bit more about the company and what they have to offer. Here's the Softflex company website, as you can see. Now, if you didn't already know, they're based out of California and it's a small family run business and they specialize in flexible beading wire, but they also carry um, their own line of craft wire as well as findings and tools and glass beads and beautiful gemstones. And they also have a wholesale discount program for designers or people who own stores and have resale licenses. Um, but anyway, today we're going to be opening up their design kit, which retails for about $32.95 and it includes everything that you need to make several projects. And I know that each kit is curated based on a theme by the uh, Softflex company staff um, every single month. And they actually had a reveal last night. So every last Wednesday of every month, they have a um, kit reveal on their Facebook uh, video uh, live video page and so um, I didn't I didn't check it out because I didn't want to be influenced by by anybody I, I like to be surprised and that's what I'm going to be doing today I'm going to be opening up I know that the name of it is called painted sunflowers but I have no idea what's in it so um, anyway let me go ahead and show you how to find that if you're interested if you tap on shop uh, you'll see all the different categories uh, beading wire beads components uh, uh, stretch magic tools but if you click on kits and you go there um, that's where all the information is on all of their kits now one thing that I uh, I was told was that the kit may not be uh, available by the time you see this video it may be sold out but I know that they have this one here which is called the Le Fleur design kit available yeah. But anyway, guys, let's go ahead and pull, the, pull out the contents of the envelope that I received today and we'll get started. Okay, here we go. All right, look at this. Oh my gosh, I love the way they package it. I'm loving it already just by looking at the packaging. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, so we have a little bit of information. Soft Flex Mystery Design Kits. Contains everything you need to bead except the tools, beads. It contains beads, wires, crimps, findings, and more. And there's the website address and the phone numbers. 
it says we love our monthly design kit challenge so buy your mystery kit when it goes on sale and then join the soft flex very important beading studio group on facebook and then uh, once you do that you can actually post pictures of your designs on this facebook group and every design you post is an entry to win the next available kit and you may use supplies from your own stash as long as they can see the kit items um, in each design so um, that's pretty cool um, you can actually post a design and win so that's a motivator right there okay so let's go ahead and open this pretty package and what's this this is a design kit challenge let's see online savings five dollars off here's the contents right here and then um, five dollars off your order for of thirty dollars or more so that's your coupon and let's see join okay so the design kit challenge uh, runs from the 25th of March through the 24th of April so that's how long you have to post your pictures um, the pictures of your designs all right so let's go ahead and let's go ahead and open up this beautiful package pretty yellow Very excited. Okay, here we go. Design elements, Jesse James. So right off the bat, it contains Jesse James beads. How cool is that? There it is. The design elements um, mix. Sunflowers mix. Okay, let's pull everything out. And this looks like a gemstone and I don't know what kind it is but it's definitely a gemstone and it's a six millimeter size let me look at the list maybe it tells me on the list it would help if I looked at the list okay it says soft flex yellow lemon quartz speeding wire that would be this one okay and I have never used colored beading wire, so this should be interesting. Um, you can definitely work this into a design for sure. And you definitely would want it to show in your design because that's the whole purpose of having it colored. And then we've got some uh, crimp tubes. Let's see where the crimp tubes are. Here they are, here's the crimp tubes. They're two by two crimp tubes and they're actually gold filled. So that's awesome. That's really awesome. Okay. And then we've got some gold tone ear wires here. Let me open it up. We have some gold tone ear wires and we have a gold plated 12 millimeter lobster claw clasp. And we have two gorgeous gold plated hammer tone rings and they're actually fairly big i don't know the exact size right now but they look pretty big let me go ahead and measure them and i'll be right back so they're about 24 millimeters in diameter pretty nice so i'll definitely see what i can come up with with these these are very interesting looking okay and then we have let's see a just jesse james beads custom sunflower bead mix that would be this one. I'm going to go ahead and open this up for you in a little bit. But yes, so these are six millimeter lapis and malachite composite round beads. And boy, are they gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see this. Let me bring it up closer so you can uh, take a look. And actually, I might even be able to turn on this extra light here. Let's see if this helps at all. I don't know if this helps at all, but let me bring them up closer so you can see the detail on these beads. It's so beautiful. Very shiny, but they have shades of blue and green. Very, very pretty. And it's a very, very long strand. Okay. It looks about, I don't know, maybe 15 inches. Pretty long. Let me see. Let me measure it real quick for you. 
yeah it's about 15 inches okay so that's pretty neat and then of course um, we have a bag of large seed beads and bugle beads let me pull them out okay so these look about 80 seed beads about an 80 size in a very pretty yellow color and then these gorgeous amber colored bugle beads very very pretty so the color theme is yellow and blue kind of reminds me of navy I have a son in the navy <laughs> and this is what it reminds me of okay so we got these and then we have this very interesting strand of blue striped triangle beads clear I don't know if you guys can see that so this this is very very interesting very different I'm looking forward to working with these beads and of course blue and yellow goes really well together if you guys know anything about the color wheel and you look at the um, uh, colors on the wheel that are that are complementary blue and yellow actually are complementary on that color wheel and if I can find one I'll pull it out and show you I finally found my color wheel but as you can see here's the yellow family and right across from that is the blue family so when you line up your arrows you're gonna see that they line up it's not exactly this shade of blue though it's more of a deeper color blue so if you look uh, at the color wheel they're across from each other the deep blues so that's that's kind of neat that we're able to you know work with colors that are complementary on the color wheel and then this other strand here this is interesting this is a, a strand of cube beads and these are orange in color and they're transparent very pretty very very pretty so I'm looking forward to seeing what kind of design I can come up with with all of these colors and then of course we have this delicious bag of sunflower beads from Jesse James so let me go ahead and open this up for you and we'll go through this bag let me put them on this bead tray so we can take a closer look at all these beautiful beads I love Jesse James beads I absolutely love working with them and I love these mixes because it just really taps into you my imagination when I see when I can see a whole bunch of different shapes and sizes and colors so we've got the blue and yellow but we also have a, a splash of green as well which I really like that I like to have you know an additional color so we've got these gorgeous pillow they look like pillow satin finish beads they, they remind me of little pillows for some reason in the blue color and then we've got these other ones they're flat they're flat but they're ovals okay we've got quite a few of these we got about four of those and then we have um, this other one here real pretty semi-faceted they're oval in, in, in shape but the, they have some very very uh, soft facets okay and then we have of course the beautiful flower tassels that look so gorgeous on a bracelet or a necklace I've used those before and then a boho bead I love these and that's a yellow and gold tone and then we've got these other ones these are flat beads as well table cut I should say table cut beads and there are four of those it looks like yeah there's four of those and then this other one I love these I had I, I did a necklace in um, a set a very similar bead but in a blush color that turned out really pretty and I love the detail on these and then we have some charms as well these are cute very very cute and we have some bead caps in a very pretty pale champagne gold color and then we also have these very interesting ones they look like uh, elongated rectangles and there are four of these 
and we have actually there's four of these faceted ones four of these we have some of these rondelles and if you look closely there they have little bumps on them little texture a little bit of texture on them sparkly I don't know what you call them they're very sparkly though and they really add a lot to a necklace because of the shine the sparkle and then we've got the green ones of course I love these green ones these are cute too faceted whoops very pretty color green and then these other ones, these have actually gold on one side and blue on the other. And they're drilled, where are they? Let me see where the hole is. Oh, they're drilled through the middle right there, okay. There's the hole right in the middle. And there's actually four, let's see, four, five, six of these. Six of these. And then these other two topaz light topaz colored beads and four of these little round ones these look about maybe five millimeters metallic semi-metallic or maybe it's like a luster finish and then these tube they're actually um faceted long rectangles and I just love this green. This is such a pretty green color. And these pyramid beads, these are cute. These are really cute. They're like little tiny pyramids. We have four of the four of these. Okay. And then these tiny, they look like maybe three millimeters. I don't know if they're two or three millimeters. They're tiny. So Anyway, this is the full collection of that uh, mix, and I just love it. I think it's gorgeous. And, of course, you know, these beads are absolutely adorable. And this is the full collection of the kit, guys. I hope you like it. I think it's gorgeous. And I know I'm going to come up with something, so uh, stay tuned because I will put a video out of the finished pieces. And um, I'm looking forward to showing you what I can come up with. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.